For Comedy Hype News, I'm Jay Will. On Tuesday night, fans will get a treat to an impromptu battle of impressions between Ari Spears and Godfrey. The two veteran comedians will showcase their best Paul Mooney impressions over on Instagram. Now at first, the battle wasn't the goal, as Godfrey would make a video earlier that evening as Paul Mooney commenting on Oprah's interview with Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. I told you niggas. I told you niggas. But you didn't want to listen to me. You, you thought I was talking shit. I kept it real the whole time. Megan, goddamn Marco, baby, 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 it's a whole new world. Megan Marco, did you see her on that goddamn Oprah Winfrey? Mm, mm, mm. She was goddamn surprised that the royal family was racist. Hmm? How the fuck in this world do you think that the whitest goddamn family is racist? You surprised? I'm so tired of Negro surprise. I'm surprised. They didn't like me because I'm black. Goddamn, you a nigga. You think that goddamn Queen Elizabeth wants some black blood, bitch? You better goddamn kick some goddamn rocks. What the hell did you goddamn think? Queen Elizabeth is a bad bitch. She's a bad mother. That bitch will have your ass killed. You think I'm playing? She, Meghan Markle thought she was in. She thought she was royalty. No, bitch. You are crown royal. Goddamn crown royal. You just got your goddamn nigga wake up call. Nigga. Now, if you didn't know, the real Paul Mooney's estate for the royal family is well documented in his 2010 comedy special, It's the End of the World, in which he takes aim at the queen for being responsible for the passing of Princess Diana after a divorce from Prince Charles in 1996. Now, as far as Godfrey's impression of Mooney, it will go on to receive instant praise, including Tisha Campbell, who will go on to comment, Oh my God, you sound just like him. Now, moments after Godfrey's impression would be released, Aerie Spears would showcase his. Spears, who very properly has showcased his Mooney impressions in the past, wouldn't pass on the opportunity to jump in and would capture his impression as a battle towards Godfrey. Paul, do you have uh, anything that you would like to say about the royal wedding that this past? That royal wedding is a joke. Niggas don't care about that royal wedding. I don't care about that royal wedding. We know that shit's false. Shit. That bitch ain't black. She's she's that bitch is kinda sort of black. Everybody knows she ain't black. I bet you England would be all up in arms if that white boy married that black bitch to Chala's bodyguard. You want a black bitch? That's a black bitch. Get that black bitch. To Chala's bodyguard. You saw her, Black Panther. That's a real nigga. That nigga nose, those nigga lips, and that bald head. Them white motherfuckers in England would have been running scared. Who's this nigga in our kingdom? That nigga knows who's he bringing that nigga here. They couldn't even handle the cream bitch. The bitch that looks like cream coffee. You put white in your coffee, it's cream. That bitch was cream. Dad, you want a real nigga? Get that nigga to Chala's bitch. Or Lupita, what's that other bitch name? Lupita, Lupita, no, no, Lupita, Lupita, no, no, Lupita, no, 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 from 12 Years a Slave. That bitch is Bernie Mac Black. Shit, that wedding don't impress me. Shit, you wouldn't impress me. I, the only wedding I care about was the one between Eddie Murphy and that bitch in Coming to America. When Hakeem got married, I was happy. Don't want to give up a royal wedding. Now, while fans were quick to praise Godfrey, it seems that most of them give the battle to Spears. One user went on to write, I hope people notice body language, eye movement, inside out do-rag, mic hold, the devil's in the details. However, the praise for Spears was not universal, with one top comment reading, Godfrey's was better, the content plus it was funnier. So let's try to settle this. If this was an actual battle, who do you think has the better Paul Mooney impression between Godfrey and Aerie Spears? Let's talk about it more in the comments below and be sure to go to ComedyHype.com for more news and comedy and follow us across all social media. For Comedy Hype News, I'm Jay Will.